loves welcome back and if you're new here welcome here in this channel we talk about relaxed hair care hair growth tips preservative styling and anything hair related so if you know you're interested in this type of content please consider subscribing to join the family so yeah this is a different from how my videos are usually like so i'm not using any sort of lighting right now because i want to make this video like more relaxing and vlog like so yeah i took out my braids or my twist four months old twist earlier on today so that video should already be up on the channel so you can check it out if you are interested so right now i am about to carry out a wash routine so i put my hair in these sections because this is how i want to wash my hair so i wash my hair in sections to prevent tagging especially when i'm so many months post relaxer so that's what i'm also going to be doing today i'm just going to start by showing you the products i'm going to use for this wash routine from my shampoo to my deep conditioner so the shampoo i'm going to be using today is the vo5 pomegranate blaze moisturizing shampoo i use either this or the clarifying shampoo but i'm currently out of the clarifying shampoo so that's why i decided to go with the moisturizing shampoo then for the deep conditioners i have a protein deep conditioner and a moisturizing deep conditioner the protein deep conditioner i'm going to be using is the afog keratin two minute reconstructor i wanted to use the afro g to step protein treatment but i don't really have the strength for that right now okay so i decided to go with the two minute reconstructor then the moisturizing deep conditioner i'm going to be using is the afro g balancing moisturizer now this is supposed to be paired with the afro g two step protein treatment but i use it sometimes as a moisturizer as a moisturizing deep conditioner alone so that's what i'm going to be using today other things i'm going to be using for this routine i have my scalp massager which i'm going to be using while i'm shampooing my hair and my scalp then i'm going to be using hair clips because my hair is currently in tweed so in the shower i'm going to take them out of the twist and clip them with this this is going to make the shampoo and deep conditioning process easier so after the wash routine i guess i'll come back and show you guys how my hair is currently like yeah you guys are not missing out much is i'm going to do the same thing i did during my last wash day routine so i'll make sure to link that video up on the screen or in the description box below so that you can check it out so what i did in that video is the same thing i'm going to be doing today so i felt there was no need to you know film it again I think the only difference between that video and today is that for today's video, I'm going to be using the balancing moisturizer as my moisturizing deep conditioner. But for that video, I used the Aussie Moist Deep Conditioner. That was what I used as my balancing moisturizer. So apart from that, every other thing is the same. So I'm just going to hop in the shower now, wash my hair, and then I'm going to come back and talk to you guys. Hi, my loves. So I'm back out of the shower i shampooed my hair with the um, vo5 moisturizer shampoo deep conditioned my hair and then afterwards i just put my hair in this cutting scarf so this is how i dry my hair immediately after i wash my hair before i go into a dry or blue dry my hair so my hair has been in this scarf now for about 30 minutes so i'm just gonna take it out i'm planning to air dry my hair i can't remember the last time i blow dried my hair i think it was during my last relaxer routine which is many months ago yeah i am currently on a one year relaxer stretch we are so many months in already like i am shocked so i'm gonna give you guys an update on that very soon like an update video is gonna be coming up so i'm just gonna take my hair out of this scarf right now so i put my hair back in twists after i used my moisturizing deep conditioner since that was going to be the last product and there was no need for the hair clips so i just put my hair back in twists and this is how it's looking like right now guys can you see the new growth can easily results of the relaxer stretch. I 
I don't know if you guys can see the coins, but I am loving it, guys. So, yeah, I'm going to air dry my hair by using the African Threaded Twist method. So, I think this is my second time using this method to air dry my hair, and I love this method a lot. Apart from the fact that African thread is an excellent method of protective styling, I realized that air drying my hair in African threaded twists actually make it straight out. So it kind of gave it a blow dry straightening effect, you know. So I like that it's a method of straightening your hair without using heat, like you don't have to use heat. So it's one of the reasons why I fell in love with it for air drying my hair. Apart from the fact that my hair is going to be in a protective style while air drying, it's also going to straighten it. So yeah, I'm going to do that using the sewing thread. You can use any thread for your African threaded twist, but this is what I usually use. Before I go in with the thread, I'm going to moisturize my hair with my go-to oil, the Prophetic Mega Good Daily Living Strengthener, and then I'm going to seal with my hair oil. Then I'm going to go in with a wide tooth comb to detangle, after which I'm going to put it in the African threaded twist and then air dry my hair. I'm going to do it section by section. So let me just start from the back.
so guys we are done and this is how my hair is looking like so i'm just gonna leave my hair in this twist till the air dry after which i'm gonna figure out what i'm gonna be doing to my hair all right so for this wash day routine guys i am shocked like the quantity of hair i lost was way less than what i was expecting like for almost how many months post relaxer and this is what i lost guys this is literally what i lost from this wash day routine like i am shocked are you serious wow i am literally shocked i am so happy with this routine i discovered that's like washing my hair in sections if you watch my last wash your routine you see what i'm talking about like not just washing my hair in sections going in individual sections like when shampooing and the rest so i think it helped a lot coupled with the fact that i did tango thoroughly before the wash routine so yeah guys that's it and guys my wash day routines are a chore like i know on this video it seemed very easy like but guys do you know how many hours i spent on this for the weekly hair wash girls you all are trying like you all have the strength i can't like i cannot now it feels like i have been washing my hair like once in three months for i think almost a year now and even with that it still feels like a chore like i am so happy that i am done with this so yeah guys that's it for my wash day routine i hope you enjoyed it if you did please don't forget to like this video if you're new here and you aren't subscribed and you know you're interested in this type of content please consider subscribing to join the family and don't forget to turn on the post notification bell so that you'll be the first to get notified whenever i upload a new video so yeah guys that's it for today's video thank you so so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye